I don't know about you guys, but am I the only one that loves the smell of matches? Oh, yeah. That got right up there. Okay. What's going on guys? Welcome back to yet another Motivational One Take Monday. Uh, this is just a series I'm doing throughout quarantine that I go over three topics that are very, very inspirational and hopefully it brings you ins inspiration. All right, to start this off, the quote of the day comes from George Sala, who said, not only to say the right thing at the right place, but far more difficult to leave unsaid the wrong thing at the tempting moment. So think about that, let that inspire you, and let's get right into the, the first topic. All right, so the first topic that I want to go over is over the past two months, a nonprofit organization called Love Beyond Walls have been setting up portable sinks to allow that homeless people the ability to wash their hands. So that is just, that alone is such a great experience. One of the reasons they're installing these, these wash stations are mainly a lot of people are saying that they fear they'll contract the virus because they have the inability to clean their hands and wash themselves. So that is one of the great things that the nonprofit organization is doing all throughout the state of Georgia. So let's get into number two. Over 400 college students in California were left overwhelmed with joy earlier this week when they found out that anonymous donors have spent $8 million to pay off their student debt after graduating. The unidentified benefactors donated the money to an organization called SRA, so Students Rising Above. And again, they donated $8 million in order to pay off over 400 college students' debt. One of the graduates named Kimberly Armstrong owed over $300,000 in student debt, and she was left overwhelmed with joy. And it's giving me goosebumps just talking about it. Uh, as she found out that she's been free from all of that debt. That Oh my God, it's giving me real... Oh, you probably wouldn't, wouldn't even be able to see it. You might be able to see it on my face. Kimberly was a law school student and just the feeling that, that all, she doesn't owe anything anymore. That is really, really awesome. Another graduate named Zachary Tab, Tab, Tab. I, I'm gonna say Tab. He owed over $160,000 in medical school debt. He was also another graduate who, who was left overwhelmed with joy, happiness, whatever kind of positive feeling that you wanna put in there. When he found out, no more. No more debt for him. That's outstanding. He told a spokesperson that his entire adult life, he, he owed something. He had debt. And just the feeling that someone would be as generous as to pay off his debt was just outstanding in its own. So for that, uh, unidentified donors, thank you. For the population of over 1.2 billion people, any news of renewable energy success in India is a cause for celebration. We th throw a party. The country's CO2 emissions fell 15% in March, 30% in April, and it is steadily declining in, in what would have to definitely be caused by COVID-19. And it was the March shutdowns that capped the new growth of power generation from coal, oil, and gas below zero for the first 12 month period in over 30 years. The increase of renewable energy went up 6.7%, which is honestly a great start. So that is really, really cool that the, the people of India are finding new ways to, to increase renewable energy production. And India has recently been setting records for cleaner air and they, they wanna keep that going. So that is just, come on US, let's hop on the train here. All right guys, that is it for today's video. If you liked it, show me some love and support by hitting the like and subscribe button. If you hated it, well, tell me why in the comment section below. Without further ado, I will see you guys in the next video.